So we know it's taking us a while, but that's because we've been, you know, trying to play everything and get as much of this game as we can. Mass Effect 3 is here. It has landed upon us. And we're going to review it. That was really weird. That's why I do the beginning. I don't know what to say. No, but I know what I'm trying to say, but I don't know how to say That's it. That's good. Leave it. We'll leave it like no, that. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> Mass Effect 3, it was really awesome. It's really, really long. It took us each like, it took me like 25 hours. I'm over 25. I did everything. Yeah, everything's good too. I did everything. And doing everything actually benefits you. Like It does. With war assets and monies. Which actually really means nothing at the end. No. We'll get to that later. Yeah. Gameplay wise, Mass Effect 3 is really awesome. Like I was saying, it Mass Effect 1 was very RPG. Mass Effect 2, was really toned down and, and, and dumbed down, and I was like, what the hell, this is stupid. But now that I play Mass Effect 3, I get it. It makes sense, like, what this game is trying to be. It's, be, be warned, though, you're gonna do, be doing a lot less walking around cool cities and talking to people and buying and selling goods and stuff because... This game is all action. It's all action and it's all, you know, a war. And it makes sense. It works. At first I was really pissed, but it, it, it works. If the Reapers are taking over this, you know, this nebula, why are you gonna go there and buy shit, you know? Like it's, yeah, it makes sense. Exactly. Gameplay-wise, it does feel a little bit kind of like, I hate to say it, I might get flamed for this, but I feel like it plays a little bit like Gears of War 3. Yeah, the combat is definitely... A lot more cover-based. If you don't take cover... Yeah. Especially like on Earth, the, the last part of the game on Earth, if you don't take cover, you, you're, hard. you're dead. Yeah. You know? I, it's, it's good though, because it, yeah. it felt really intense the whole exactly. time. Exactly, the combat, yeah, it's actually like really like... Meaningful. Like it's hard. Like it's yeah. it's it's a really high pace and really like fast paced game. Yeah. And it translates really, really well to the multiplayer, which is also really pretty good. In terms of the story and everything, the story's awesome and the characters, you know, you have a lot of characters coming back from your previous games and your relationships with them and romances with them. It all comes back and it's really, really awesome, just like usual. Um I'm very big with uh like character relationships in games, like growing attached to the characters. Yeah. And this is the game that like you know, does that. Like, towards the end of the game, I was always like, I hope Garrus doesn't die, I hope Garrus doesn't die, I hope, like, because, you know, like... Because Garrus is the fucking man. Yeah. So, like, and it's just, seeing all these, it's just like, you know, it's like the last movie. Yeah. And like, let's bring back every fucking character. Yeah, it's like, goodbye, 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 goodbye. You know, yeah. especially, like, if you played Mass Effect 1 through 3, and you had it, and you played on the same system, you're, and you've never lost a character, mm -hmm. besides Caden or Ashley, because one of them has to die, you see them all. Yeah, yeah, which is really cool. Yeah. Game looks great. It's getting a little outdated, but uh, it, it looks really great. But the art direction is fucking incredible. There are parts when you're walking around and things look absolutely amazing. Yeah. There are parts you walk around a battlefield and you see battles going on in the sky above you. And it's so cool. I've grown uh, pretty addicted to the multiplayer. It's really, really fun. It's just like Gears of War Horde mode, you know, waves of enemies that come at you. You just survive. That's it. But it's really fun. You you know you you gain experience points. You level up your character, like the different powers. You buy weapons and this and that. And it's really fun. It's it's definitely something that I will keep on playing. A lot less tacked on than I thought it would be. And the yeah. fact that it ties into single player a little bit is is nice. I thought I was just gonna be like, here's Mass Effect Three. Here's a multiplayer. Yeah, no, it wasn't like yeah. that though. Yeah, it was like, all right, here you go. Like it's yeah. good. It's, it's, I, I enjoy it a lot. I'm happy. And there's already um, rumors of DLC, multiplayer DLC, which yeah. brings more classes. Cool, bring it on. Yeah, Variety's I'm cool. Variety's so, the spice so of life. So fucking down for that. As for the ending, the the ending that everyone is freaking out about, uh, I was fine with it. I was fine with it too. I don't want to sign any fucking petition about it or anything. Like, no. I'm just like, that's how no. they chose to end it. You were telling me, you know, it could have been better. And there were a couple little weird yeah. things about it. This is no spoilers, by the way. There's a couple weird little things about it that I didn't like, but overall, I'm fine with the ending. It's a good ending. Yeah. I'm satisfied. Especially uh, if you wait till after the credits, it's like a little best part, like 25 second like thing. Yeah, maybe best even part. shorter. Best part of the ending. And it wasn't really totally. It's, it wasn't like oh, there's gonna be a sequel. Not at all. Not yet. But it was really cool. Yeah, it, it felt really cool. Um, they did kind of make it like a sequel. There's one other. I mean, they, they, they said like oh, it's getting late. One more story. That's what I was thinking. I was like, yeah. oh, okay. Mass Effect 3, the ending, uh, a lot of people are pissed that everyone has basically the same ending, but with slightly altered parts to it. I think this is fine, just because Bioware had a story that they wanted to tell us. Our job was to 
show how it was told through our decisions and stuff, and that's really cool, and we develop our own relationships with the characters and change story aspects, but at the end of the day, Bioware started the story the way they wanted it, and they wanted to end the story the way they wanted it, and it ended pretty decent, so I don't want it to be changed. I'm completely fine with it staying the way it is. And you're fucking retarded if you want it to change. Sorry, guys. We under I understand some of the complaints. I do. Yeah. But, but come on. To the know? extent that it's gone to? I've, I've been pissed off with a lot of other... There's been so many bad game endings. Especially this generation. So many bad game endings. No one's petitioning to change those. So... I don't know. Internet's full of fucking idiots, man. <laughs> So that's what it comes down to. <laughs> yeah. It's just Sorry. Idiots. If you're looking to pick up Mass Effect 3, I highly recommend that if you haven't played the previous two, get those first. Because it's definitely a game that has to be, you have to play all of them. Yeah, I Just I, to I, enjoy the story, just to enjoy the characters, absolutely. watch these characters develop, you have to play them all. Absolutely. freaking loopy. I mean, you can pick it up and play it. No. No, but I I'm, say no. Alright. Don't well. even touch it if you haven't played one or two, because you're just missing out. On something so awesome, it's like tag me, like emotion. I know. I'm, I'm just saying. I'm saying like it works by itself, but no, it doesn't. <laughs> it does. <laughs> but if you don't play them, if you don't play the, the, the trilogy, you're just an idiot, and you're wasting. You're missing out on like a fantastic yeah. story. It's like watching the third Lord of the Rings, and not watching any of the other ones. Why would you do that? So for Mass Effect Three, we would happily pay sixty dollars. Sixty dollars, well spent for a freaking awesome story, a fairly satisfying conclusion. Pretty decent multiplayer. Yeah. I'd, I'd gladly play $6. It was a really, really good emotional experience. I love it. Me too. So you guys, let us know in the comments what you guys think about Mass Effect 3. Please, let us know what you guys think of the ending. We're really curious to see what you guys think. But try and keep the spoilers light for other people. But let's see what you guys got to say about the ending, because we want to know. It's crazy. So, boom. boom.